two things before I start this video. I feel like I sound like a man. <laughs> I feel like I sound like a man and that's because I'm kind of sick. Number two, um, try not to focus on the fact that I look like a kid with these pigtails, okay? I didn't know what else to do with my hair. So if I think it's cute, then it's cute, you know? That's, that's all that matters. Today's video um, is going to be my one year later and also my final review of the African black soap that I talk so much about on my channel and I promise you guys I am not sponsored I was not paid to talk about this soap whatsoever in my original review of the soap I had wrote down if anyone is interested to see a one year later review and also a final review of the soap let me know and I was actually shocked a lot of people reached out to me and asked me if I could do a one year later review and also a final review so here I am doing just that so yeah, I'm just basically going to answer the top five most frequently asked questions that I received in the comment section of the original review of the soap. Feel free to check that video out because I'm not really going to go in details as much in this video. And I'm also going to give a few tips and advice of what I did and things like that. And it's just going to be really short, really smooth. I promise y'all it's, it's not going to be too long. Okay, like I don't have time to be talking too long because I'm sick anyways. <sighs> and I'm already out of breath. Oh my God. I'm out of breath for some reason. <laughs> All right, so question number one, can it help with my dark marks? Um, yes and no. Um, to some extent, I feel like the soap can eventually get rid of your dark spots, so if you've been using it for a while, but I would not recommend someone to strictly buy the soap to get rid of your dark marks because I don't feel like the main purpose of the soap is to get rid of your dark marks. I feel like in the process of getting rid of your acne, it might get rid of some of your dark spots dark marks same thing um, for example I still have a few dark spots on my face and I've been using the soap for over a year now so question number two in the beginning how long until you started seeing results uh, let's see um, the first week I was using the soap um, it was really rough I'm just like what did I get myself into I'm like I don't think I'm seeing anything the second week I'm just like results is that you? I'm like, nah, too good to be true. But the third week, I'm just like, okay, for sure the soap is working. Um, I started to see... Yes? Okay, my Vini. That was Creole for I'm coming. I'm not coming yet. I'm, I'm, I'm recording. So yeah, after the third week, I realized that, okay, the soap is actually working. I'm just going to keep using it. So if you've been using the soap for more than three weeks and you have not seen anything good or bad, like, you know, either good results or bad results, then maybe the soap is just not working at all. Or, yeah, sorry. <laughs> I mean, yeah, sorry. <laughs> I'm not trying to be funny, but, um, yeah. Question number three, where do you buy black soap? Um, surprisingly, a lot of people were asking me that. So I would definitely say to check your beauty supply store, hair store first. And if not, you can check eBay or Amazon. But definitely check your beauty supply store first. When I first purchased the soap, I got it on eBay and it was $5. And I'm just like, oh my gosh, so cheap. Uh -huh, yes, I got a deal, right? About two weeks later, I went to the hair store. And they had it at the hair store for three, four, five at the hair store. Three soaps for $5 at the hair store. And I bought one for $5 on eBay. So I was mad. I was, I was really, really mad mad man i was really mad man question number four did you experience a purge phase before it got better so i guess did it get worse before it got better um yes it did like i said the first week i was just like oh my god oh my god what is this like my face was just so dry but i feel like it's because i was overdoing it like i was overusing it i was just so desperate so yeah the first week was really rough the first day was like even worse my face was just so dry it was just like ah <laughs> like it was just so dry and eventually after like the third week I started to see like a difference like my bumps my pimples like completely dried out yeah it did get worse before it got better but I'm just thankful that it did get better all right so the last question is how many times a day do you use it twice a day or once all right so like I said in the beginning I was really desperate and I tried to use it three times a day when I had the chance and that was in the morning when I wake up and in midday if I was off of work I would use it as a mask and leave it on for like 30 minutes to an hour no bad idea and I also use it at night before I go to sleep and eventually I figured that was not like a good idea like my skin was just too dry and I just stick to using it twice a day which is just morning and nighttime uh, so that was pretty much it for the questions um, like I said I was just gonna answer five and next move on to the tips that I have for you guys is tip number one is to just have a great moisturizer because 
the soap is drying okay like it's, it's drying second tip that I have is try to document your face either by recording or take pictures of the same side of your face every week or every month just to see if the soap is actually working and another tip that I have is try to drink a lot of water I feel like a lot of people kind of like neglect that the first month of me using the soap I went on a water diet I was just drinking the right amount of water that's for my body and I felt like that kind of helped the soap to work faster although it's kind of hard but if you can try to drink a lot of water while using the soap and I promise you your skin will thank you later and the last tip that I have is try not to use too many other facial cleansers or try not to use any other facial cleansers while using the soap. Just because you want to see whether or not the soap is actually working or maybe the soap is not working because you're using some other facial cleansers that has some ingredients that's not working with the soap. So try not to use too many facial cleansers or if you can try not to use any other facial cleansers at least for a month while using the soap so you can, you know, figure out whether or not the soap is working for you and you can either keep using it or just stop using it and just you know go on with your life so yeah that's pretty much it for the tips and questions that I had for this video so one last thing I wanted to address is to keep in mind that the soap may or may not work for you just because in my original review of the soap a few people were not coming for me in the comment section but they were just like saying oh my gosh I, I use the soap and my skin is worse it's not working I am not a doctor okay I am not a um, what do you call those people dermatologist I just use the soap and it worked for me and I'm basically putting it out there for anyone who's like suffering with acne it worked for me it worked for a lot of people that I know I've used a lot of products too when I was going through my acne phase and they did not work and eventually the soap worked so yeah just keep that in mind and that's it that's all I had to say um thank you guys so much for watching this video feel free to ask any other questions that I did not answer did not answer in the comment section and I'll definitely try to answer them thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see y'all next time in another video peace